Welcome to my YouTube channel Samula Khan 92. Today our topic is about train chiller adaptive control diagnostic uh, issues. Uh, how we can check the diagnostic problems of train chiller. So today we can see how we will check the diagnostic issues. This is our train chiller. Uh, before we discuss about chiller report, refrigerant report, compressor report, and operation, operation settings. Uh, so many things and today our topic is diagnostic so we can see here this is the uh, written here diagnostics we can press this diagnostics uh, uh, then the pro, uh, information warning this showing us information warning like this for diagnostic info we can see info diagnostic status report uh, Last diagnostic compressor overload setting, compressor overload setting is uh, showing. Uh, compressor overload setting, compressor informational warning, and then it's showing it show us uh, press enter to clear diagnostics. If you want to clear the diagnostic, then you uh, can press enter here. So we can uh, clear the diagnostics. So it's coming historic diagnosis have been cleared. Then press next again. Uh, press enter to clear circuit 1 diagnostics uh, if you want to this show us the circuit 1 diagnostic then we will press again to clear this circuit 1 diagnostics also then again press uh, it's uh, showing us uh, press enter to clear circuit 2 diagnostics now so if you want to clear this so we press again enter uh, and now let's see we press next again what it to show us press enter to reset control and clear all active diagnostic this will uh, clear complete uh, diagnostics for our chiller uh, so when we press this enter active diagnostic have been cleared system is restore, restoring so reset local it show us stop local now uh, so this is all about the uh, diagnostics problems uh, it uh, what is the work of this diagnostic uh, in chiller it show us uh, what issue is coming in our chiller maybe your water flow switch is not working maybe the freon is less maybe uh, uh, freon is going high pressure sometimes a uh, condenser fan is not working it will go to the high pressures so this uh, is the work of diagnostic it show us uh, it show us uh, what is the problem in our chiller if you have any issue maybe your chiller is closed you first of all you have to check your diagnostic diagnostics in this chiller so it's a uh, very easy way to uh, go to your fault easily you can search your fault where is the problem in your uh, chiller so it's all about the diagnostics today uh, we will discuss other things also about this adaptive control if remaining. Uh, so keep in touch, like and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching my YouTube channel.